This segment of Delmarva Life is brought to you by Sussex County Federal Credit Union. We're very excited to announce that we have a great family who's going to um, act as our first family, and we'd like to congratulate the Evertons of Seaford, Delaware, yes. as yes. our first family. He is cute, isn't he? <laughs> Do you remember that back in February of 2012 when Sussex County Federal Credit Union announced the Evertons as, of Seaford as their first family? Well, the goal was to help the family reduce their debt and increase their savings with the help of the credit union. So, how's the family doing? Well, Brian Spiro stopped by their home to see how their financial well-being has changed in almost two years' time. The last time we checked in on the Everton family, they were setting themselves up for financial freedom with the help of the Sussex County Federal Credit Union. Fast forward to nearly two years later, and what a difference. They have another son, Charlie, and are living quite comfortably. We've been able to put money aside, we've been able to save for things, we've been able to do more with the money that we had. Um, so that's made it a little bit nice to be able to do a few things that we needed to do. With the help of the Sussex County Federal Credit Union, Jamie and Phil say they've been through refinancing, budgeting, and a debt reduction plan. They also opened savings and holiday accounts. This Christmas, for example, because we've set up our holiday account, um, you know, we were able to plan and actually add to it a little bit since we had our second child and this Christmas isn't as much of a, I'm going to say, financial burden <laughs> on us as far as buying presents and, you know, that, that kind of thing as it has in the past and that, that's been fantastic for us. Jamie says they've most noticeably been able to build their savings. It's been huge. I mean, you know, we're, we're planning on taking a vacation now for our five year anniversary was actually the end of November. And once um, the baby's a year old, we're actually planning on going on a trip and celebrating that. And before, there was, there was no way we could have done that. The Evertons say having that money readily available has also helped them take on projects around the house. So we went through and figured out how much it would cost to have people bring in equipment and try to like clear up the rest of the property. And it was gonna be, I think, around like $50,000 to be able to get everybody in, get the equipment, get everything done. So we ended up buying fencing, building a barn, and buying goats for a couple thousand dollars. And the goats just go along and eat all of the stuff that we don't want in the yard, clearing everything up for us, and it should increase our property value. Phil and Jamie also say having money set aside has given them a great deal of security. Before, if something were to happen, I don't know what we would have done. Like say, say for example, we have homeowner's insurance. Our deductible is $1,000. I don't have any idea if something were to happen where we get the thousand dollars from. Whereas now we actually have a savings account. If we need to pull from it, we can. Debbie Jewell, business development manager for Sussex County Federal Credit Union, says the Everton family's financial success is an example for any family. Our whole goal is to help our members reduce debt and increase savings. So seeing that in action and seeing it a year or two after we even met with the Evertons and started the process, to know that that program is still working for them is fantastic. Phil and Jamie will tell you they would not be where they are today if it wasn't for the Sussex County Federal Credit Union. The credit union, by being able to sit down with us and have that one-on-one -on -one and say, okay, look, here's, here's where you guys are here's different options, this is what you can save, and then this is what you can do with those savings. You know, you can create a holiday account, you can have a CD, you can, you can do these things, and you can have multiple accounts. It's okay if you wanna put some money here for something and some money, you know, somewhere else. And, and you have access to all that online, like you can, you can do so much with your money. And, and it's, it's up to you. And, and by them sitting down with us and kind of going through it, it made it not as scary. The biggest thing they have to offer is letting you know what options there are. And they have resources for all the different things that you could do to save money. Jamie adds having a clear picture of your finances and being able to look ahead is key. I use a computer program to keep track of everything um, on, on my laptop and I actually update it all the time and I, I plan for um, like I know his gas is going to cost X number of dollars every week and I, I go ahead and put that in, you know, so, it, so it's scheduled so I can see where our money's going in the future. So if we have an extra hundred dollars here, I'm like, okay, I can buy, you know, this much 
different types of things at the grocery store or if we're going to be short this amount of money I'm like okay I can finagle here or whatever just to kind of balance out and it's nice to look like say a month ahead to kind of see where everything breaks down and that's been super helpful. Finally Debbie says no matter what financial state you're in no matter how bad you think it may be Sussex County Federal Credit Union can help get you on the right track. It's a huge relief and probably one of the uh, most common themes that we hear when we talk to different members and prospective members is that I, I don't know that there's enough money to save, but once they realize that there is, they come back and they tell us it is so nice having a holiday club account or it is so nice having an emergency savings fund account available because my washer and dryer just broke. I didn't have money to go out and buy them, but I actually was prepared because of money I had in my savings. So it is very, very rewarding for us to know that it can help people at a time when they really need it. The Everton say as they head into 2014, they will continue to save more, be methodical and plan ahead for their growing family. Quite a success story, but you know, every family's financial situation is different. Debbie Jewell says you shouldn't be embarrassed to reach out for help if you need it. Aside from the help they offer in their four branch locations, Sussex County Federal Credit Union also has resources on their website, including online calculators to help with your financial planning. And for more information, go to DelmarvaLife.com. Just click on the show tab. While we're talking about saving, you have a chance to save one of the many cats and dogs here on Delmarva that are looking for a home. We'll connect you with a few of these cuties a little later. <laughs> Plus, members of the Emanuel Wesleyan Church take the Delmarva Life stage to give us a preview of their upcoming musical, The Christmas Shoes, and to sing a couple of Christmas classics for us. And the Christmas cheer continues. We've been giving away gift cards to some of your favorite Delmarva businesses this holiday season. We'd like to announce our final two winners. Now, our first is from Sussex County, Lori Whittle of Lincoln. You won a $50 gift card to Shore Water Refining in Dagsboro. Our second winner is from Somerset County. Mary Marsh of Crisfield, you won a $50 gift card to Coquino's Creative Jewelers in Ocean City. Congratulations. Delmarva Life, we'll be right back.